I, uh, I do international travel, uh, sales for international, and uh, I was going to Australia. And uh, I was at one of our biggest customers in Australia. And my cell phone rings. And usually when I'm traveling, very few people, and most people know I'm traveling, so when the cell phone rings, I have to look at it. <laughs> and I look down and it's Debbie. And I'm like, she knows I'm in Australia. She knows I'm probably visiting a customer, so this is important. I need to take the call. So I excuse myself and I, I kind of step out into the lobby area and I take the call and she's crying and I'm like, what's wrong? She goes, I have pneumonia. And I kind of go to the hospital and I'm like, good, good Lord, you know, I'm. Eight, literally 8,000 miles away and there's, there's nothing I can do. And that's tough. When the whole thing happened and I was in the hospital, from the time I was in the hospital till I came home, everybody from the church was there for us calling, ringing food, even before I knew anybody was going to be bringing anything to me, all of a sudden it was the Arvizus at the front door yeah. bringing us food. And we're Mike like, had a casserole. Oh my goodness. I mean, it was just great. It was, it was hard to accept because you think, oh, I'll be okay. But no, I needed the help. What, it was because you reached out. What Debbie might not have known, or maybe she I didn't did. know this at the, at the, at the time, time, no. As soon as I hung up the phone with her, I immediately called Pastor Tom and made mm -hmm. sure he was aware of the situation. I said, look, you know, I'm in Australia, Debbie's home, she's got pneumonia, she's got to go to the hospital, needs treatment. Um, you know, can you lift up a prayer, you know, and, and, and reach out to the church family? And uh, of course. We got both. You know, yeah. <laughs> For me, being that far away, the gift of presence was the, you know, the huge peace of mind that Debbie and, and my family is going to be taken care of by my church family. Um, you know, I mean, it's just you have this immediate um, thankfulness, this warmth that says, you know what, I'm so far away, I want to jump on a plane, but. It's not really practical, but I, I know that, you know, my church family's there to take care of, of my family, and, and that's huge when you travel. I think it was, it was almost more for Chuck than it was for me because I was so out of it. I was just, I was really sick. And so I don't think I would have even thought to ask for help from anybody. I was so far gone. So he asked, and the church family responded. Well, that's easy. Through working through all of the church family, through the prayers, them bringing nutritious meals for me and the two kids, constantly calling. Yeah, that immediate warmth, that immediate yeah. response. For me, that immediate relief. knowing. Yeah, relief. Mm -hmm. Perfect, thank you. That immediate relief that it was taken care of. I didn't have to worry about it. That is what's amazing. Yeah. That's, 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 that's the presence of God right there. It was a great presence. Yes. You know what, now that I think about it, it was probably the best present we've ever received. And it didn't even have a bottle. <laughs>